So this is an example of a broken radius, or often called a wrist fracture. And this is the radius bone that lies in the arm like this. This is an example of a left radius. Oftentimes, uh, someone will come into the emergency room with this injury, and there'll be a, an attempt to put the bone back into position by pushing on it, and then putting it in a cast. The problem is, if the bone is comminuted or crumpled on the back side, the bone has a tendency to want to shift back out of position and kind of get tipped out of place. You can see on the palm side here, there's a ridge between this part and this part, and this part is shifted back out of position. If it heals in this position, there's probably going to be some limitations of motion, there could be pain with motion, and can go on to develop arthritis. So options for treatment when it's out of place, or sometimes if the bone is in more, more pieces than this, what we call comminuted, will often offer a surgery to put the bone in a better position. What the surgery involves is making an incision on the palm side of the arm, move the muscles and tendon inside, we get down to this bone, we're able to free up some of the attached tissues and mobilize the piece of broken bone to get it in a better position. Once that bone is mobilized, we'll fix it with a plate and screw. This plate attaches the two pieces together, so now instead of them being separate and out of place, the two are held together. This plate doesn't heal the bone, it lets the bone heal in the right position, so it acts as a, like a cast inside the body or a strut holding the one piece attached to the other so the body can then heal it. Normally after surgery people are in a cast or some sort of splint for about 10-12 days to let the incision heal. Once it heals, the cast comes off, stitches come out, and then we go into something removable to work on the range of motion. So instead of the six weeks in a cast and hoping that the bone will heal in the right position, by six weeks time they're moving their wrist quite nicely and usually it's a matter of me trying to hold them back from doing too much instead of just getting them out of a cast and working on the range of motion. This is something that stays in, it does, generally does not come out, and once the bone is healed, its activities is tolerated.